Hi everyone, Connor here from Team Block Daemon. Following our last video where we introduced you to our Block Daemon Builder Vault and its robust TSM capabilities, today we're diving deeper, focusing on the transformative potential this technology holds for Wallet as a Service providers and their clients. Let's explore the innovative features that set Block Daemon Builder Vault apart from the rest. Secure connectivity between nodes is vital, but it's also expected. The true innovation of our Block Daemon Builder Vault lies elsewhere. What really sets it apart is how it empowers digital asset service providers to host MPC nodes, facilitating non-custodial models. Imagine establishing a complex yet secure signing ecosystem where not just the wallet provider, but multiple clients can actively participate. So what does this mean for financial institutions? You can go beyond traditional wallet management and offer revolutionary new services like shared wallet accounts. This isn't just a security upgrade, it's an entirely new business avenue. One of the groundbreaking features of Block Daemon Builder Vault is its ability to allow multiple mobile clients to connect their apps and create shared wallets. Each client and the wallet provider have a shared TSM and cryptographic keys, democratically controlling the account. The result? Shared accounts for personal or business use have never been this secure or flexible. For financial institutions, think of the possibilities. You could offer investment collectives or collaborative asset pools, each with its own unique multi-party approval mechanism. In a shared wallet scenario, our Block Daemon Builder Vault provides options for different multi-party approval schemes. Whether you want only the client and the wallet as a service provider to co-sign transactions or require multiple parties for high value transactions, Block Daemon Builder Vault gives you that granularity. Imagine having a standard hot wallet for daily operations while also offering a separate high value asset wallet requiring multi-party approval from multiple authorized users. You're not just offering a product, you're offering tailored financial solutions. Stepping it up, our Block Daemon Builder Vault also allows the wallet as a service provider to completely opt out of hosting any key shares. This means clients can host all key shares themselves, exercising full control over their assets. It's wallet with self-custody like you've never seen before, fully democratizing asset management. For institutions, it's a golden opportunity to pitch a high level of asset control as an invaluable service feature, meeting the demands of an increasingly autonomy-seeking clientele. Unprecedented flexibility, tailoring custom M of N schemes for bespoke wallet needs. Here's where Block Team and Builder Vault truly distinguishes itself its unparalleled ability to let you tailor custom M of N approval schemes for different wallet scenarios. Let's break this down. Firstly, what is M of N? In cryptographic terms, it specifies how many participants or nodes, M, must contribute to meet the minimum threshold for authorizing a transaction out of the total number of nodes involved, N. With Block Daemon Builder Vault, you don't just get a basic M of N setup you have the ability to customize these numbers to an extraordinary degree. Now, consider the applications in a real world scenario. High frequency trading desks. Here, you might want quick approvals to capitalize on market movements. You can configure the system so that only a couple of trusted nodes, M, out of a larger pool, N, need to approve a transaction. This keeps things agile, allowing for rapid execution without sacrificing security. Long-term treasury management. In contrast, when dealing with long-term high-value assets, you might want to set a higher M value, requiring more participants to authorize a transaction. This provides an extra layer of scrutiny and security, precisely what you need for substantial long-term holdings. Compliance-conscious operations. Regulatory requirements differ dramatically from one jurisdiction to another and from one asset type to another. Block Daemon Builder Vault allows you to adjust the M of N settings to fully comply with regional laws or specific asset regulations. Interdepartmental operations. Imagine a large financial institution with various departments handling different asset classes. With Block Daemon Builder Vault, each department can have its own unique M of N scheme. The risk department might require unanimous approval for any action, while the trading department might allow for more flexibility. In an age where financial autonomy is not just desirable, but crucial, Block Daemon Builder Vault offers unparalleled flexibility in setting up and managing TSMs. Whether you are an individual client or an enterprise, the power to define your security landscape is now in your hands. For further exploration, click the link in the video description box below to talk to the Block Daemon team today.